Okay, I'm going to start on uh, <clears throat> the second side of the bottom air pan, and I, my machine is still at zero in the center of the of the part, so I don't have to redial in. So I'm at zero. I am going to switch cutters. I'm going to go to a smaller cutter. I'm going to go to a quarter inch uh, two fluid uh, end mill uh, to mill the second side. So. First thing I gotta do is go set my or change the end mill. And we'll set you up here. And change that end mill out. Got a two flute, two flute quarter inch end mill with a three eighth shank. Okay. <clears throat> I've loaded the program and I'm sitting at at Z1 inch. So I will take my one two three block and uh, and I will adjust that crank the knee up until I just touch. Right there. That will be zero. I mean, actually, that would be one inch, one inch above. And program is loaded up. I'm going to run the graphics one time, make sure everything looks okay. Okay, I'm not, my graphics is not running here for some odd reason. It has lost. My uh, controller has lost connection to uh, the machine for some reason. So that means I'll have to shut down my software. I'll have to shut down my software and restart my machine. So I'll come back to it when I get uh, machine restarted. Okay, I re uh, restarted my machine. Every now and then it'll, it's like it loses its connection to the controller and I'm not sure why it wants to do that. Uh, my controller is a laptop basically, it's a laptop running the software, controller software. Uh, and it's like it loses its USB uh, connection. So, But anyway, <coughs> I ran the graphics, everything looks good, so I am about to hit the start button. Gonna do the hole in the center there first. And now it's plunging down. I never did find my brush. <laughs> I get to uh, the hardware store off and buy me a couple more.
This is a 30, it's supposed to be a 31 thou undercut. The center fits on the carburetor flange. That's what it's doing right now. Now it should be milling the bottom of the pan. The reason I switched to a quarter inch end mill is the material's getting thin and with a 3 8 I'd end up with a little more chatter because it's, it would put more cutting pressure on it. Right now I, I reduced the cutting pressure to try to eliminate some of the chatter. Plus, plus I slowed down all the feed rates. Not really taking enough material to uh, heat up the cutter or anything. <clears throat> it's really nice outside today. It's find it hard to uh, be inside. It's like uh, I think it's 52 degrees out. Plus, I'm getting to the point now on my bill that I really, I really do hate to put it away for the summer. I'm getting anxious to uh, get the cam in and actually try to uh, get it running. I'm getting closer. Don't have, we do have a radiator. That's going to be a big project yet. I have to. I've got all the material laying here for the, the radiator, but. I haven't uh, even looked at starting that yet. Although I really don't need the radiator to uh, <laughs> run it the first time anyway. I just fill the block with uh, coolant. And Still have this, still have this uh, coal hanging on to it. <clears throat> a little bit of a scratchy throat, nose running yet. Feel 100% better, but all the side effects haven't gone away yet.
see if I have one more time around the horn here. And it'll do the finish pass. And then it'll plunge down and do the, the profile. Cut it out. Yeah, there's the finish pass around the inside. Then it's gonna then it's gonna come in, come over and plunge down through it and go around it. And it should just drop down. Oh actually I got a finished pass around the outside too. That's kind of a needless pass there. Should get around over here and then come through. Okay, it should come over. Should come over. Oh, it's going to start on the other side, okay? That's fine. And now we're, now we're actually cutting her out. Hopefully it won't bounce up and down too much. Or collapse here, it's getting pretty close to the edges. Should have started with a little bit bigger block. Major failure. Wow. <laughs> that should get your heart pumping.